Hello, this is Bluetooth continuing my play Fire Emblem walkthrough. With defeating the boss. Which one should I use? Well, I want to defeat the boss. So I use the Manikati. Yes! Ladies and gentlemen, Lin's critical. That time I did more damage than his hit percentage. Okay, let's see what everybody else can do. He can pr protect the wall. The wall is safe. Zane's not going to do anything. Except Florina get as many battles in as possible. Right through the heart. Level up. Level up. More defense. So what, now they're gonna do zero damage? Let's have Kent get in here. The Dorcas isn't completely under fire. He's 11. Let's see. Let's have him wait here, right here. There we go. He'll be fine. No damage! And he misses anyway. But he still, she still can't double. She needs some more speed. Miss. Oh yeah. The drought is over. The criticals are pouring in. Dork just has to do better than that. Maybe now he will. Come on, it's only been seven turns. It's not even dark yet. I'm barely alive. I've shamed you all. Remember that? Why did you speak with me? Well, obviously you're coming with us. You're our unit now. You'll need the most watching over. Ken has the longer shift. Well, that may be some mercy. She must be telling that to Sane. Ken's invincible right now. Okay. No, they don't. Moving on. The next morning comes too quickly. Lynn has fought back the bandit's attack. Now, she rushes for the border of Burn. If she can reach it, Lycia itself is not far off. For a moment, Lynn stops to imagine the face of a grandfather she's never seen. Here come more bandits. No one expected that. Chapter 5, Beyond the Borders. We've almost reached the Pythian border, huh? Hopefully. Too many bandits around here. And yet we've never met those Taliver bandits. 
They must be the one bandit group we never run into. I'm not thinking it's just been the Ganelon bandits over and over again. Saying lost two self esteem points. slowly disappearing. Oh no! They're getting uglier every time. It's that lackey again! Playing. They're gonna go after everyone. Although the last ones did too. And the ones before. I would like to take a moment to allow the audience to brace for impact on the greatest character in the game. Urk! That's right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Urk. No, not her. The one with the purple hair. Yeah, Urk, the greatest character in the game. And the first magic user we get. He will teach you the meaning of anima and awesomeness. Oh yeah, and she's the first healer. Yes, yeah, a unit that can heal other units. But that's not as impressive. <laughs> For those of you who have heard of Radiant Dawn and Path of Radiance, Urk is the Soren of this game. Fight, 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 fight! <laughs> oh no, it's the common minion! <laughs> yeah, right. Match Urk. I don't think so. Ha 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 ha! There is no matching Urk. So wait, if the common minion's an archer, where was he in the last mission? We took out all the archers. And I think there was just one. Okay, Sane, you know the drill. In fact, uh, give that to Florina. She could use it, I guess. Um, let's wrap this up here. Talk to Sarah and you get both. This music plus Urk equals even more awesomeness. We'll use Urk next time on the Play Walkthrough. Thank you.